latest in the Rajori terrorist attack, there has been a blast at the house of a victim at Dangri village. At least two people have been injured. The nature of the blast is still unclear. Four civilians were killed and nine others injured in a targeted attack in Rajori district of Jammu and Kashmir. Officials said at least two armed men resorted to indiscriminate firing at villages Dangri village last evening. Let's listen to what the senior police official is saying. जो जानकारी प्राप्त हुई है उसमें दो आतंकी आए थे जिन्होंने तीन घरों को निशाना बनाया अपर डांगरी के गांव का इलाका था जो थोड़ा सड़क से हटके है जिसमें चार लोगों की कैजुअलिटी हुई है पांच और जख्मी हैं जो दो जख्मी यहां लाए गए हैं वो अभी स्टेबल हैं रजोरी में भी जो जख्मी हैं वो भी स्टेबल हैं तलाशी अभियान जारी है पुलिस सीआरपीएफ और आर्मी के ट्रूप्स ने उसे पूरे इलाके की घेराबंदी कर ली है तलाशी अभियान शुरू हो जाएगा बहुत जल्द हम कोशिश करेंगे कि इन दोनों को न्यूट्रलाइज कर दिया जाए सर अभी तो कुछ पता चला है कि कौन संगठन इसमें सब अभी इसकी जानकारी नहीं है अभी तफ्तीश करेंगे तो पता चलेगा राइट and for more on this i'm being joined by my colleague nazir masoodi nazir uh, new year not starting on a uh, on a right note perhaps in that area but there's also a band which has been declared well uh, there's another tragedy in the same uh, area in the same village in the same house that came in the attack in a terror attack last night there's a blast they are outside the home at the home or outside home in which several people are injured at least three including two minor children uh you know are reportedly critical um, there are reports of casualty we are waiting for the confirmation from the police but it is it appears to be a really really big tragedy in a sense that yesterday there was attack on the families three families when militants barged into the homes carried out this terror attack and 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 killed four innocent people around nine were injured then this morning there was a blast at one of the victims home uh in uh, dongri village uh several people have been injured as i mentioned earlier at least three including two minors are uh, are critically injured uh, uh we are waiting for more information from the police but um, it is it is really in a sense tragic and uh, you know surprising how can there be explosive left there because whenever there is an incident the first thing police go and they sanitize the area they see if there is any leftover explosives or they may have left them some explosives so if this is an explosive left by the attackers yesterday then it is a huge huge security breach as well at the same time innocent people who have come there to console the, the families the victim families to come to their to to to, to be part of their grief there they became the victim and and several people have been injured there is a band in rajouri people are protesting senior officials of the administrative alj administration have reached there and assure people that uh, we will take action and a operation has been launched to track down the attackers but that is too little as uh, solis for the victim families and the protesters this is the second incident in last two weeks where innocent people have been killed in firing in rajouri on 16th of december two innocent civilians were killed who were working as a laborers in an army camp were killed outside the army camp army said it was a terrorist firing but the locals and the relatives said they were killed in the army firing uh, a probe has been ordered we are waiting with that that probe report is yet to be made public having said that in this attack locals say how the you know gunmen they came and barged into their homes last night in dongri village at least three residential homes and you know uh, resorted to indiscriminate firing it's clearly a target attack where a certain community was targeted dongri village is a predominant hindu village and they have clearly marked the village and carried out the attack it's unclear if the group who are involved behind in was behind this attack had recently infiltrated because just few days back there were reports that army has observed some suspicious movement along the line of control rajouri and open fire as well but this is a shocking incident because this area was largely free from militancy for almost two decades but for last one year we have seen series of incident there were serial blasts in april then there was a major fidayan attack on army installation in august in which army soldiers were killed now this brazen brazen attack where innocent people have been targeted this is a targeted attack they go inside they barge into their homes and kill innocent people now as the people were still mourning the dead and were preparing to cremate them 
there's a blast and there's another tra tragedy. Several people have been injured and some of them, including children, are critical. Right. Thank you very much, Nazir, for those details. Targeted attacks being reported in Rajori. And uh, the blast... And what we have been hearing till now is blast in Rajori, the, in, in a village, two have been injured. And uh, the details that have emerged is this seems to have happened at the same spot. Uh, in fact, in the same house where the earlier incident was reported as well.